the problems that we were trying to overcome during my time yes. and the problems that exist today yes. are the same. Okay. They have not gotten better. Right. In fact, in many respects, they've gotten worse. Sure. And although we have tried uh, to address some of these concerns, yes. because the problem is quite large and it requires not just one individual, but many individuals to overcome this. Yes. I think it's a, it's a big hurdle, especially when you have uh, a lot of elements that okay. work against you. Okay. Chiefly amongst these elements is, um, I think, this corruption of knowledge. Right. I mean, before we spoke about this, and I think if we were to try to explain what this means, yes. if uh, someone who is not, or some, yalla, someone who is not uh, prepared yes. to clearly understand and elucidate yes. a certain uh, element of knowledge, mm. he is not qualified to, and therefore, whatever he tries to propagate mm. will not be what it actually is. In other words, if someone gives you a piece of knowledge okay. and you claim to have understood it and mastered it, okay. but then when you try to teach it, it becomes different, okay. different for the worst. Yes. This is the corruption of knowledge. And this is actually what happens in the Muslim countries today. Right. We don't understand many things, and yet we claim to understand them. Yeah. Now, early